Hey guys, and thank you for tuning back in. This is the Button Smashes YouTube channel, and I am Zach for TheButtonSmashes.com, and that is my dog Tetra. That is right, I like the princess off of The Legend of Zelda Wind Waker. See you later, Tetra. And this is the Gamdius Hermes P3 RGB gaming mouse, guys. And if you guys have been paying attention, we've been doing a Gamdius uh, run recently over at TheButtonSmashes.com. Hey, Tetra, sit. Um, and if you guys have been paying attention, we did the Zeus RGB P1, um, Zeus P1 RGB, sorry, my bad, uh, has double level RGB lighting across the top and across the bottom, but looks freaking sweet on my computer desk, which is over there. Um, we will be over there in a second checking out this keyboard. Um, but as well, it also has a 12,000 DPI up and down uh, with presets. Before that, guys, we checked out the Hermes E1 and Dementor E2 um, from Gambius, which is their combo, the Hermes E1 combo. It's a sweet little entry point uh, into the gaming market, and uh, we really loved it over at TheButtonSmashers.com. But today, we are here to talk about the Hermes P3 RGB. So, let's crack this bad boy open, pull it out, I'll give you the first initial thoughts of it. Um, and then we will move over to the computer, check out the Harris software, which is the custom Gambia software, guys, that runs all of the Gambia's products, um, and we will run it through its steps, and I'll give you guys some more feedback on it. So as you guys can tell, nice, good packaging on it. Um, pulling it out of the box. Plastic backing with an alloy frame around the top of it, um, has nice beveled edges. Keys are low keys, so it is a uh, slower or a quicker, uh, quick response time, guys. So there's not as much force or any type of pressure you need to go downward to actually get that full click. Um, the keys are quieter than the other um, keyboard that we current have currently running right now, which would be the Hermes E1. Um, so if you guys can listen to it. That is definitely a lot quieter of a click. So not as loud, not as annoying to the people around you if you're gaming with other people. You guys also have the key popper. So you guys can slide these underneath, pop out keys, and clean your keyboard to keep that nice and clean. Um, Cause you know we're all getting the Dorito chip dust underneath there. Um, so yeah, nice way to clean it up. So let's take a second, um, head on over and check out the Hermes P3 RGB. Give you some more of the specs behind this keyboard um, and show you what the Harris software can offer you. All right, now we're over at the computer desk, guys, with the Harris software loaded up. As you guys can see on the screen, we have the Hermes E1 laying down here in front of us currently. Um, but what we're going to do is I want to show you guys, see these down here and down at the bottom of the Harris software, you guys have your Gambius registered product. So that's the Zeus P1 uh, RGB that we're currently using. You guys can check out the review over at TheButtonSmashers.com. It's already done and said. But then if you click over here, we've got Hermes E1. That's from the Hermes E1 combo, guys. That's the one that comes with the Demeter E2 uh, gaming mouse. I want to show you guys how plug and play friendly the Harris software is. Um, so we have... The Hermes P3 RGB here, it's never been plugged into my computer before. But what we're gonna do here is we're actually going to um, undo these Hermes P3 and replace it, the Hermes E1, with the P3. So, um, here in a second, guys, let's see which chord this one is. As you guys might have just heard, but more than likely can see, the keyboard just turned off and we uh, just lost the Hermes E1 guys on the Harris software. So that's one beauty thing about having a software designed specifically for uh, the Gambius line. Uh, everything works, it's plug and play friendly. As I'm gonna show you guys here, we're gonna plug in the Hermes P3 RGB. We're gonna get a beautiful RGB welcome, I'm sure. And again, we have not done, I have not plugged this in yet, checked it out or anything. And we are lighting up this world. Um, so, try to get that back into a better frame for you guys. Uh, hopefully that's good. I can't really tell while I'm recording. So, hopefully that works. I don't think it does, but hopefully it will. Um, anyways guys, we have key assignments. 
so you guys can do the general key changing all the keys on the Hermes P3 RGB or the FNG uh, macros. Uh, you guys can change that as well. Macro management, you guys can control all the pre-programmed uh, macros or make your own. Keyboard luminance, guys. Um, we have a color picker, so we can go through and change our to whatever color we want. Um, we have a minty to a green to a red to a brown, orangish to a real orange to a blue. Um, all over the place, going over to a pink. We can make it more red if we'd like. Grab this little slider. Oh, maybe not. Oh, there we go. Slow response. Um, anyways, you guys can also do your own picture number. Uh, you just want to load a picture? We can, we can try. Oh, it has to be a JEF file. I don't have one. Sorry, guys. Uh, but we go down to lighting effects, which is sweet because the lighting effects, a couple of these will actually be crossovers with the Zeus uh, RGB that we're currently using from Gamdius. Uh, so we got raindrops, guys, which is uh, always falling on my face. We can always change the speed of them. They're currently at 10. Drop it down to a 2. Maybe it's a light shower. Um, or just a light mist over at one. Every once in a while we'll get a drop. Oh, that's speed zero. Speed one. Every once in a while we'll get a drop. Down to a torrential downpour uh, tsunami at level 10. You guys can always change your brightness as well. So if that's a little too bright for you, you guys can change it from 0, 30, 60 to 100. Um, we'll just do a little bit of a lighting effect. Jumping over to breathing, we always love to breathe here at the Plug and Play Podcast. We recommend it on a daily basis. Plug and Play Gamer is a big proponent of breathing. The button smashes.com. It is, uh, it's up to you if you want to breathe or not. But we can always change that stack coloring to uh, on there as well. Change the speed of your breath um, with the brightness as well. Moving on down to a wave. Wave effect, as we all know, you guys can change the direction of the wave. Um, if you guys want to be left to right, right to left, up to down, or you know from bottom to top, top to bottom, um, and as well change that speed so you guys can actually tell and enjoy that wave, ride that wave out. Um, that's going to be a rainbow. Uh, you can also do the marquee, um, which is going to just move it for around, as you guys can tell right there. You guys can pick your color as well. You can pick your color as you go. Um, but they also do have another one in here, I believe. There's a ripple. So, if, um, if you guys want to change the speed of the ripple so you guys can actually see what's going on, there you go. Whatever key you hit, it's going to ripple out like a pond effect around that place. The nice thing about this keyboard also is it accepts different multiple inputs, so you can do multiple uh, ripples on it. At the same time, so if you're hitting control and one over there, you're gonna have a wave that hits and collides and continues on whichever side has the most momentum. Um, responsive fade in. If you guys are want to see how fast you can type, how fast you can light up the keyboard, that will uh, surely be the way to go for you. Or you guys don't want to see at all, you can just put it for speed of 10. We're gonna put the speed back down to five just so we can see what the heck's going on. Um, neon colors, guys. This is another effect that is available on the Zeus with the dual, double layer RGB. Um, I'm currently not using it. I'm using the Wave. You guys can't tell that. It doesn't really matter. But that is a cool effect. I do enjoy the Neon Wave. Colorful marquee, guys. This is what I was telling about if you guys want the colors to switch around. It's kind of Christmassy colors. Uh, green leading the way, red right behind, and then white, silver, blue, or something like that. I can't really tell because it's going a little too fast for me. Um, rainbow drops, guys. Uh, that's gonna be all different colors the rainbow dropping like it's hot Circular marquee guys. That's gonna be kind of like a uh, pac-man effect going down to the inside Speed it up or like a snake effect uh, if you will if you had that Nokia phone um, And yeah, so slide in You guys can see what that's doing. It's literally just sliding in and out in and out in and out and rotation guys this is just rotating around. But again, you guys can do left to right, right to left, um, up and down, down and up. So 
that is the lighting effects for this I do enjoy the rainbow drop so we're gonna go with that and let's move on guys sounds in timers so if you guys have a need for a sound function you guys can go ahead and pick a sound and assign it to a key Timer. I'm not going to set a timer, but you guys can do a timer if you'd like. Sound file editor. Guys, if you guys really want to get into it, you guys can uh, import, make your own, uh, edit, and customize your sounds right here. Timer settings as well. Create a timer um, and get that all set up. Nice thing about the hair software, as I pointed out in all my other reviews, you can update all of your products right here from the hair software. So currently we are... We're up to date, um, and we don't need to worry about that currently, but you can check for updates, checking, checking, checking. Ah, uh, nope, we uh, have the current uh, update. You can check for your hair version software. I'm not sure if that's up to date. It is, and as course, you guys can always get the online support from gamdius.com. So that here is the Hermes P3 RGB um, uh, review. Uh, thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to check out the written review over at thebuttonsmashers.com. Uh, like this video over at YouTube. And follow us on all of our social media. At SiteTBS on Twitter. At Gamdias. G-A-M-D-I-A-S. Uh, if you want to check out their stuff as well. They're doing some awesome holiday giveaways this season. Um, so head over there. Be holly jolly. And maybe get yourself something. So until next time. Thanks for tuning in. Hope you guys appreciated it. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope you guys will check it out. Um, yeah, we'll be back.